Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to today's YouTube video, where today we're going down to the mall because I am kind of looking for those Scare Fair Halloween pops. We talked about this in yesterday's video. I'm hoping we can honestly find those today, and if we can't, hopefully we find something else that will, you know, suffice for the video. So, think if you guys are new, make sure to smash the like button and hit the subscription. It helps with the channel immensely. We're trying to hit a thousand, so every like, subscription, comment genuinely is very helpful for me as a content creator. Plus, we also are going to be going down and open, you know, opening some Lorcana packs today because I did already have that recorded. So, just knowing that video when I do at the beginning of the like opening I talk about Lokana how I was talking about Ghostface and all the like horror stuff just know it's pre-recorded so sometimes it doesn't match up with everything that happens in the video but I just want you guys to know that little like like you know just to kind of know what happens so with that being said let's get down to the mall and hopefully find some scare fair pops first store they have which is a box lunch they have like Damien they have Bakira from the Jungle Book Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle ones right there uh they have the cookie monster look how clean the cookie monster is. dude he's literally about to just drop his kitchen domain like look at that thing that's a great pop maybe I'll pick that up there's also like Star Wars they do have the John Wick chapter 4 but the box is damaged so I'm gonna pass Chucky another Chucky they have Harley Quinn my melody couple just random ones that demo organs kind of cool they have those gt ones and bleach and then if you kind of pan up there you guys can see just some of the newer moments and stuff but that's pretty cool and if you go down here they have like russell with sash wendy from the peter pan set which is kind of cool now that i've seen the movie but i don't know if i'm gonna get that today that's a bruno they have another bruno and then the black light of the evil witch or evil queen frosted flakes guy snoopy kind of mascots here they even have the mermaid which is kind of random now that i've seen the movie but they also have the mascot of the uh from the book from the new um, nuggets and then just come around random puzzle. let's get down to hot topic now hot topic they do have like the flamed wingman and gohan goten just a couple of bleach ones they have this new winnie the pooh set more funko fusion ones they do have like the small little chainsaw man or not chainsaw man pops the leatherface pops they do have technically one for this. They have the Ash, but I don't know if I want to get that one. If you go farther down, they have like Snoop on a stoop. Kind of just some random ones. Biddy Pops. They do have, like if I go over here, they do have Zoro. And I might get a pickup for today. It's the old, the newer Zoro, but the from the original base. And then if I kind of pan through, there's those. But let's get to GameStop. We're in GameStop over here. They do have like Beavis, or this is Cornholio, I should say. And that's Beavis over there. They do have heat on, not the chase, just the common. They have Godzilla. They do have a couple of the black, uh, no, black, yeah, black clover pops. Some of the Gamma One and Gamma Two. Uh, they do have another one from Buffy. They have the Gentleman right there. There's also Finks back there. They have uh, Beavis. They have Godfather, Machio. A lot of the Pokemon ones. Uh, they have a Beetlejuice. Again, kind of just kind of pan through everything. Yamato, Tangan, and Uzui. They have a lot of really cool pops, honestly. And if, even if you go up there. And then if you go to the bottom, they do have like Ultimate Mecha Maru. They have Ruined Roxy. They have some Power back there, which we have, I think, shown on. No, we, I think we might have shown Makima, not Power. And then keep scrolling through that way. There's a bunch of cool pops. So now let's get back to the house and show you guys what we did find. Alright, now, so now before we get to the Hot Topic Scare Fair stuff, let's showcase some Lokana cards we do have. And then we'll talk, and then we'll showcase the pops we did pick up for Scare Fair, which is basically the Halloween event at Hot Topic. And this, this is pretty cool, honestly. So I figured we would showcase this to talk about it, because again, it's a pretty cool event. They had some pretty decent stuff, honestly, if you were into like the Terrifier, Scream, things of that nature. So let's see what we can crack open here. Start off this first pack. Let's see if today is going to be a good day for car openings. Again, this is set four, so I am um, been trying to get more of set four because, uh, and I really like to get more of the into the England, but set four is where we're at currently. Okay, let's see. Okay, we're at a rare. We got another rare of Goofy, and okay, and then a Pluto. So nothing too crazy. That's about a standard pack right there. That's what you're usually typically supposed to get. But can we pull something crazy here? I don't know what I would be called crazy from this pack. Because uh, I don't, again, obviously enchanted cards. That's always welcome. A legendary that I don't have or just another copy. Again, any legendary is welcome. Because uh, who doesn't like not want more cards, obviously, for the collection? Flounder. Okay, a rare. Okay, we got a super rare of Peter Pan. This is the Shadow Finder. And we got another Winter Camp, which I pulled tons of during my card pull collection so off to two decent packs we got peter pan and i don't remember if we've opened up that peter pan on this channel yet we might have showcased that peter pan already so that might not be a new card of course if you guys are followers of the page you guys would obviously know if i use those cards in decks and you know what cards i do have over time of course it's too many 
but like most packs, the typical beginning like cards are usually the ones that are just like your filler cards with like, and there is some harder ones to get, obviously. But okay, rare, rare, and common of Donald. So we're um not kind of cooking honestly with this one. But it just means that the pops are going to be cooking. Because obviously, Scarefair was genuinely pretty cool. Comment down below, were you guys happy with this year's Scarefair? Or did you guys want something different from Hot Topic? And I do not know if they're going to release more pops, obviously. But obviously, we do have themed videos coming along for Halloween and stuff. coming Or October, I should say. So just keep that in mind. That there is going to be more uh, videos that are Halloween themed. This isn't just the only video we're doing. It's just that this is the first one that's coming to mind. Okay, okay, and we just pulled that one, and then we got a rare of Ursula's Garden, and then we got Super Goof. So, uh, yeah, we were not cooking, honestly. We did not get anything that was really um, on the hunt for, but let's get to the pops, because that's what we were here for anyways. So now that we did the Lorcana aspect of the video, we, um, yeah, we, as you guys saw, we went down to the mall, not just Hot Topic, like I mentioned. Again, a lot of times the card portions are pre-recorded clips where I like kind of recorded prior to me going to any store. So I kind of assumed we were going to go try to find those uh, Scarefair Pops. Plus, I was also hoping we were going to be able to the factory. We all thought we were just going to Hot Topic, but we ended up going to the whole mall. So we do have some Pops up, or a Pop, I should say, because I really didn't find too much that I was on the hunt for. But we did end up picking up this John Wick from Chapter 4. So I decided to pick this one up for the factory that, one, there's only two Pops in this set. There's only, as you see the close-up. There's pretty much only two pops in this wave, and it's basically just uh, John Wick, and then there's Winston, which is basically the guy that runs the uh, Continental. And um, I love this movie. Great, like the way I love how they put the poster in the back of the back of the box. Genuinely looks crazy. This is a great pop in my opinion. And the fact that he's holding the katana, and then he's holding the nunchucks right there. Super cool. Again, that was a pop I've been kind of wanting, and I again I talked about it when I did a Funko News Friday a long time ago because it's been a while, and I said I wanted this pop, so I finally was able to get the opportunity to pick it up finally. So of course, who wouldn't want this? Because again, John Wick is one of my favorite franchises of movies. The fourth one was still great. One, two, three, and four were all good in my opinion. The other John Wick pop I do have, and it's kind of over there, is basically the one from Chapter Two, I believe, where he's just holding his like weapon, and um, that's not the chase, but and I don't have the first one where he is with his dog. I just have the second one, so I'm missing like, a couple more John Wick pops, honestly. So it was definitely a set that I intend to some point just fully finish because there's not very many in the ways. Because it's pretty much just John Wick with his dog, the chase, um, then there's a John Wick from Chapter 2. I don't think they did any for Chapter 3. And then just this one, and then Winston, if I do see Winston. And um, I definitely probably will just to complete it, because there's not too many in the wave anyways. I did think this was a pretty cool pop. I was hoping to go Scarefair pop, and though, as you guys saw, we saw Evil Ash, but that was it. So I decided to pass on that one, because it's not a movie that I cared about. They didn't have Leatherface, they didn't have the Arthur Clown, or the Ghostface. So sadly, I wasn't able to get those for you guys, but I was able to still showcase that there was a couple things over at Hot Topic for Scarefair. And of course, this isn't going to be the only Halloween-themed video I have planned for the rest of the month. We do have a lot of cool Halloween-planned videos, so don't worry. Just because we didn't find those pops today does not mean that we're not going to do more. But thank you guys so much for watching. I did have a great time recording this and having a good time hanging out with you guys. So I will see you guys today with that Spider-Man 2 stream, and then yeah, peace.